Hi guys, uh, welcome back to another video. Uh, I think I'm going to play through Metal Slug 4. Uh, I think that's what I'm up to in the series. Uh, I've already played through Metal Slug 1, 2 and 3, so please check out those gameplay walkthrough videos. Uh, I'm just going to um, give this one a go. This originally came out on the Neo Geo um, MVS arcade system and then later on the AES home version. Uh, I actually do own this on the MVS. Uh, I have an MVS arcade machine. Uh, I do own this game. Uh, I think I own all of them on the, all the Metal Slug series on the Neo Geo MVS, apart from Metal Slug 5, I believe, and that's because that uh, cartridge goes for a hell of a lot of money these days, but I am still hopeful that I will get a copy of that at some point. Uh, I think I'll stick with Marco, always use him, the original. Not really familiar with this game to be honest with you, this is the one I'm least familiar with in the series. Um, well actually no, that's a lie. I generally, when I put Metal Slug game on, I usually play either 1, 2 or 3, uh, I don't really go beyond that, I don't know why that is, but uh, anyway, play through this. Just really enjoyable games, and to, to be honest, ah, oh, sneaky. To be honest with you, um, these are the games that I associate more with uh, the Neo Geo than, than any other games, uh, because I, I still remember seeing the. Um, seen the original in the arcades back in the day and uh, I just couldn't believe it. Thank you. you know, the animation, the graphics are still amazing even to this day. It is like a mini cartoon as um, one of the subscribers on my channel um, mentioned. Sorry mate, I forgot forgot your, uh, your username, but uh, you know who you are anyway, but uh, yeah, he absolutely loves these games, and, and so do I. Oh no. Okay, I'm on a motorbike. I'm not driving it, I'm just in the side, uh, side car. Yeah, you know what, there's slowdown in these games and... Oh, jumping. But, you know, they're still enjoyable. I'm wondering whether this game is as long as uh, Metal Slug 3. If you watch my gameplay video on that one, uh, it went on for I think an hour and 20 minutes. Okay, is this the boss? It is.
Try to duck him, Nick. Using loads of continues, <laughs> not really familiar with this game. But if you played one metal slug, you pretty much played them all. Is that the level done? It is. to the next mission. Mission to start. Oh, what was that? Some sort of rolling bomb. Aha. Oh well. It's just amazing. Oh, that's a shame. I was enjoying being in that. Need eyes in the back of your head playing this game, you really do. Oh, I just, I just love it. You know, even after all these years, these games just never get old. They never do. Maybe that's just me. I'm liking the vehicles that you. Uh, that you get in. Someone else is obviously driving them, but uh, yeah, it's a good element. Oh, it's a bit dodgy. I mean, I've obviously played this game because I own it on the MVS, um, but I don't remember playing it. Honestly, don't. It's been that long. Hi. 
Bada boom. Oh. As I pointed out before in, um, I, I think in Metal Slug 2 and 2 or 3 that I played, uh, these are the actual censored versions of the, um, uh, uh, of the games. Uh, they don't have the blood when you kill the enemy. Um, I don't think they were the censored versions, I think um, it was more to do with the territory they were released in. Uh, I think Japan got the blood, uh, Americans and, and the UK and Australia um, basically didn't. So um, on the MVS and the AES, if you have the uh, Unibios, you can actually just set it to Japanese or turn the blood on. So, you know, that's what I'm familiar with when uh, playing these games. But this is alright, and I think on the Neo Geo Mini that I've got, uh, that's the international version, and again, there won't be any blood. I've seen other people um, review those systems uh, on YouTube, and they don't have any blood either. They're the sort of sensitive versions, but it doesn't really bother me, to be honest with you. I know that I've got the, um, the uncensored or, or the Japanese versions of the games, so... You know, it, it doesn't bother me, but um, but yeah, on the on the Pandora's box, uh, at least with this version, version five, um, it does appear that uh, those are the versions that that you actually get. Oh, I'm doing very well here. moving oh, it's that big guy big Rambo guy that's made an appearance in every Metal Slug game so far we've seen him in, uh, in Metal Slug 1, 2 and 3 it'd be interesting to see if, if he's actually in in, in the uh, in Metal Slug 4 Sorry, Metal Slug 5 and 6. Losing my marbles, can't remember what, what Metal Slug game I'm actually playing. That's brilliant though. And is that another boss done? I think that it is. Excuse me guys, if, uh, if I'm sniffing throughout this video. I uh, came down with um, man flu and... Uh, a week or so ago, a couple of weeks ago, and uh, I just can't seem to shift it. Ah, oh, there we go. Nice snow themed level. Uh, it's fitting with Christmas coming up. But uh, I'm in Australia, I've been living here for well over a year now, and um, so this will be my second Christmas here. 
and uh, it's not the same here in Australia. I mean, I'm from the UK, and uh, obviously, you know, I moaned about the cold weather in the UK, but uh, around Christmas time, it's quite fitting, really, uh, and the build-up to Christmas is far bigger in the UK than it is over here, and, um, yeah, I, I do miss it, and, and my kids miss it, my wife misses it, but... Uh, yeah, I do miss Christmas time in the UK. Um, we were hoping to go back uh, this Christmas just to see everyone and, and just to have another Christmas in, in the UK, but um, but it doesn't look like it's going to happen, so that might have to wait until next year. So, uh, yeah, another Christmas here in Australia. So, uh, last Christmas we visited some friends and uh, Boxing Day um, we spent actually in the swimming pool <laughs> because... Uh, it really does hotten up here uh, in Australia, sort of in the last couple of weeks, it's really got warm. I think uh, today it was in like the, the late 20s or early 30s and Friday it's going to be 37 degrees, so yeah, really, really hot. I do like the warm weather, but just at Christmas time, um, because I'm from the UK, just used to it being cold around Christmas time. So that's going to take some getting used to. Don't know what's happening there. Oh, this is really tricky. The levels are getting uh, getting more and more difficult. Yetis, or Sasquatch, or Bigfoot, whatever you want to call them. Oh, wasn't expecting that. Slug games. Oh no. Continue. to be stuck on the uh, on the screen then oh no I thought I was going to fall oh how on earth did he kill me right oh, I hate jumping bits guy again, the general. He was uh, abducted by aliens in uh, 
in Metal Slug 3. What's that? Slow down. I don't think that's. Uh... Oh, oh got to be careful of that. I think the slowdown was always part of these games on the original Neo Geo system. So um, you know, unless I did a comparison side by side and, and ran the original. Um, MBS cartridge uh, in my MBS cap, which I may well do at some point. Um, there does seem to be a hell of a lot of slowdown on this though. Oh, shouldn't have stayed there really, that was silly. Keep bringing on a chopper, which is uh, slightly annoying. Oh, I never did that hit me. And that's another boss done. Mission four. Mission four, start. Come on, let's shoot some Germans. If there are any Germans watching this uh, this video, uh, then I mean, I mean, uh, no offence by uh, my comments. But nothing against Germans. Oh, what is this thing? It's not doing a lot of good, is it? Oh. Oh, that is pants, isn't it? Oh. Still try it. Oh no, I didn't need to get back in that. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Still there. Give it another go. It is pretty shit though. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's get back in it just for a laugh. Okay, where do we go? Oh, let's go up here. See what's going on down there. Oh my god! Zombies! I've seen them before. going on the screen. Oh no, what's happened? Turned into a, uh, oh no, can't even, couldn't even uh, jump over her then. At least I got the ones that side. 
<laughs> oh, did I get back in there? <laughs> oh, gotta get out of it. and turn me into a bloody zombie. animation, the death animation. It's fantastic. Oh, look at this boss. Do you know what? I definitely, I mean, if I have played Metal Slug 4 before, which I'm pretty sure I have because I would have tested out my cartridge when I got it, my MBS cartridge, but uh, I, I've never got this far before. And I've done it. What a strange boss. No prisoners, damn. Mission complete. And that is mission four complete. Mission five start. Oh, pirates. Thank you. 
What's that? A forklift. <laughs> forklift truck. Oh. These vehicles, though, don't do really well in them. No, I'm going to stay out of that, I think. I'm going get in that one, though. Did he get me then? <laughs> you got two Germans there uh, sunbathing <laughs> on the deck. <laughs> oh, fantastic. I need to take him out. Sometimes you just lose track of what you're actually doing and, and, and what's on the screen and where your character is. <laughs>
missiles going. down there. Brilliant. That was a nice easy way to kill that boss. Going. Final mission. Final mission. Being lowered down on some sort of rope. Oh. Trying to move forward, those guys with the uh, shields, it's pretty lethal. Who's this dude? Oh, I'm a monkey. Brilliant. I've turned into a chimp. Oh, not for long.
Oh, damn it, I wanted that weapon. I don't know why it's crap. <laughs> I love the weapons in this game. <laughs> Look at the, uh, the graphic effects when you fire the laser. Your character's face and his um, and his hair all sticks up. Oh. Jump straight on that. and low. Well done, get it all armor. <laughs> oh, zombie general. Terminator or something. dodgy moves.
machine gun. Got it. Where are we going? Where are we headed? Another one, this side. to that uh, that blade. Oh. Let me get something else. Oh look at this. This is amazing. those lasers. What's in? Oh. Is that the end? Just like the uh, like Metal Slug Part Three, we've got to try to escape now. Oh no! Oh no! I take it I didn't escape. Oh, what happened? Did I die? Mission complete. Mission all over. So I wonder what would have happened if uh, I hadn't have died then and I would have, um, oh, 31 continues. Yeah, I wonder what would have happened if I didn't uh, get caught by the um, explosion then and they got through. I wonder whether I would have got a different ending or, I don't know. I will never know. Brilliant, I enjoyed playing that. Oh, here we go. Oh, I ended up in hospital. 
not too bad though, get a nice uh, blonde nurse looking after me. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed the gameplay video, and um, this was Metal Slug 4, uh, playing on the Pandora's Box 5 arcade stick. Um, The next one in the series I want to play is obviously Metal Slug 5 uh, and then finally 6 which uh, I'm the least familiar with because that wasn't on the Neo Geo system, I think that was on the uh, uh, Sammy and Thomas Wave uh, which I never actually owned. I've played on, I've actually played on a uh, Sammy and Thomas Wave, um, the guy I bought my uh, Neo Geo MVS arcade cabinet uh, from, he actually had one and he put that on and I played a couple of games on that, so uh, I didn't play Metal Slug 6 on it, it didn't have it, but it had some of the other games, so um, yeah, um, so if you like what you see, please hit the like button, and subscribe to my channel, I hope to get more and more gameplay videos on, not just on the Pandora's Box 6, which, uh, sorry, Pandora's Box 5, which most of my gameplay videos at the moment seem to be on, but just other systems as well, I want to do some arcade games, um, some old retro PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2 games I want to play, uh, and also on the uh, Sega Mega Drive or the Genesis. Um, I just want to play more and more games, uh, do more gameplay walkthrough videos, and uh, unboxing and reviews. So I hope you like what you see, guys, and I'll see you for another gameplay video, which may well be Metal Slug 5. Cheers, guys. Thanks. Bye.